So I've been working on our visa packet. And this shit stressing me out. Like, it's so, so much paperwork. Um, pretty much, I got the letter of intent to marry. Um, this is the actual paperwork. 13 pages that I have yet to fill out. <clears throat> I have all of my uh, trips to see him and one for him to see me. All my confirmations from the flights. And then I started to put together these little things. How did we meet? What text messages and pictures? My first time going to visit him. Uh, second time going to visit him. Third time going to visit him. You get the point. But we've been fighting about it because it's like he can't help me. And it's stressing me out so fucking bad because I have to do every fucking thing. Like, kill me right now. I'm just mad annoyed. But we're going to make it happen. And we're going to be together. Forever. The way you live each day is a sentence in the story of your life. Every day you make the choice whether it ends in an exclamation, bitch out here looking like a snack, tonight. a question mark, or a period. My days in and a little bit of all of them. It's Jay's days. <laughs> so it's Valentine's Day 2018, and I had a package shipped. Well, not a package, but a little Valentine's Day thing from the um, flower shop that's across the street from Bay's job. Um, they're going to deliver it to him today. So I'm actually waiting for my phone to ring because he should get it any minute. And I want to see his face because I love making him happy. And I know it's a surprise. Like, he was kind of asking me why I'm asking what his schedule is this week. But, you know, I'm always up to something. <laughs> so, I found a place to deliver some nice little, it's like a, a mug with some flowers and a teddy bear and a balloon. It's not a lot, but I had other things I wanted to do, but it just didn't work out. And I was running out of time, so I just had to get something. Because I'm not going to let this day, the most special day of all, well, not of all, but one of my favorite holidays pass without him feeling good so he doesn't know that it's coming so I can't wait for him to call me so he's calling thank you for your surprise <laughs> <laughs> you're welcome my love yes it looks wonderful Aww. Nice. <laughs> I've been waiting all morning and I'm like, oh my god, oh my god, my nerves. <laughs> and I'm recording. <laughs> you know. Aww. I love you so much. <laughs> I love you more. You know, I can't let today pass without making my husband smile. Jeez. Thank you so much, man. I don't know what I gotta do with all of y'all, sir. <laughs> you're welcome, my love. Yeah, you're such a yes. Yeah. Of course. Yeah, thank you so much, man. <laughs> oh, they just call me say something is here, but I was like, oh my god, one day this judgment outside. <laughs> I know you thought I was coming, but oh God, whatever. Sorry that it couldn't be me, baby. Did you? Oh, thank you so much, though, baby. I appreciate it so much. Did you? Did they have a card with it? Yeah, baby, I just read it. Oh, okay. Let me let me take a peek of it now. Yes. Put it on my DP. Same from baby. 
<laughs> Take a picture of you with it. <laughs> All right. Take a bit. Take a selfie with it. All right. Did it come with a balloon? No balloon. <laughs> Just the flowers. Oh my God! I don't think it was supposed to come with a balloon, but did it come with a teddy bear? All right, bye, baby. Okay, bye. I love you so much. Love much. you. Hi. Um, I placed the order yesterday, and it was actually delivered today. But you guys forgot the balloon and the teddy bear. It was to Delroy Hilton at the Fish Shack. Mm hmm Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's actually supposed to be a love you balloon and a small teddy bear. So that's it? Okay. You sure that's it? Okay. You gotta take a picture of the whole thing now. <laughs> I said now you gotta take a picture of the whole thing. Okay, I will be later. I'm busy a bit now, alright? Alright, bye baby. All right, love you. Love you too, bye. At work, babe, send me Valentine's gift. Oh, she's so sweet, yo. I love my wife so much. So I've been slacking on this whole visa process. I was supposed to finish in February and I'm still fucking doing it. Because I took a break and the shit is just stressful and time consuming and babe is pissed at me now because I didn't finish putting the papers together. But you gotta understand that I'm doing a fucking page on every single visit that I did and that's been like 10 fucking visits. I have to gather every single fucking plane ticket, booking, then we have to submit letters, I have to get passport photo redone, get his passport photos copy of my birth certificate it's so many fucking paperwork like this shit is really annoying and it's not easy like i guarantee if he was to do the shit it would take him like a year I did a page on every time i visited or when he visited so this is how we met little paragraph some text messages our first text message ever to each other that's our first picture to each other that's the second picture. <laughs> and uh, that is when I went to go eat at his restaurant. I saved the receipt. That was the day we met. Um, <clears throat> this was my first solo visit to see him. That was our first date. And I actually paid. The fucking bill was like 140 I treated him to that. That's just a few messages between us. Text messages, a little bit, you know. So this fast forward to 2017, I didn't see him for a long time. Um, that's when I brought all the girls and he was helping out or whatever. We kind of rekindled in 2017, July for his birthday. That's us dancing. <laughs> um, so this is August when we started to kind of really, really fall in love. Our first YouTube video. Some text messages talking about how much I love him and what I like about him and some different uh, messages about us moving to Florida. Then it's the time where he proposed to me and so I put that story in a few Facebook messages. Then it's uh, we send out our engagement stuff and we spend Halloween together and... Then we had the engagement party where he came to New Jersey. All the pictures of friends and family. 
and stuff like that. So then the next one was this recent visit, Christmas, and I also put the car accident because I wanted to show that things are not fucking perfect. We are not a perfect couple. We do go through things. Um, that's Christmas. That's New Year's. Just a random pick. And so, yeah, that part is actually done. Um, now, this is all of my confirmations for all my trips, except for the most recent one that I am surprising him in March. Um, so I just got to print that one out. This is a letter saying that when he gets here, we will get married within the 90 days. Uh, E-notification, so when they receive my application, they'll email me. Um, this, is this the, oh yeah, so this is the actual application, it's 13 pages, I don't have to, so yeah, 13 fucking pages, gotta fill out of all of this information, pretty much, it's a lot, like a lot, a lot, a lot, <clears throat> annoying a lot, so this is just, I'm just showing this just in case anybody else is trying to apply, um, we need two passport photos, which I have to print out on two by two photo paper. Um, I need to put my birth certificate included. Um, I need to pay five thirty five. Um, yeah, pretty much that's it for that. Like all the proof and stuff. At first, we were gonna do just the adjustment of status, but we decided to do the fiance visa. Because it's like safer and even though it is.